forgiveness and we want to hear what these girls have in mind can somebody tell us what do you think forgiveness is my name is Cindy Kyare and I'm in form 2. I think forgiveness is the act of letting go the pain and suffering that someone has caused you. Very good. I hope you have heard that. Somebody else? My name is Crystal Kibadu from 2. And I think forgiveness is the act of forgetting whatever a person did wrong to you. Yes, that's another explanation of uh, forgiveness. How can you manage to let go the pain that somebody has caused you. Okay, my name is Leah. I'm in Form 1. And uh, you, can manage, you, you can manage that anger that you have by, by when you look for somewhere where it's just you alone and then you like cry it all out or if you, if you feel like screaming, you scream or you can even hit the ground or something near that is, won't hurt you and it's not another person. And then after you are done, you pray and God will surely help you. That's a, that's a good explanation. Somebody else? My name is Ashley. I'm in one, uh, one hitch. And I think one can be able to relieve herself of the anger but is by writing down all the emotions that are inside you so that you can relieve yourself. Very good. I'm sure you are gaining something from this uh, students and uh, somebody had a question about forgiveness can we hear my name is joy i'm in form three and uh, there are these people who may hurt you you feel that pain yes you go before the lord and you say you have forgiven them but anytime you look at them you still feel that pain and you feel like they just hurt you all the time what are you supposed to do i think uh as a child of God or as somebody you know God, you're supposed to love them and uh, pray for them and pray for your heart. Work on your heart in prayer and God will guide you. At the same time, love those people because there is no forgiveness without love. And there is no love without forgiveness. So when you learn to Pray for your heart and also love those who are hurting you. With the time, God is going to heal your heart and he is going to help you come out of it. I hope you have gained something on our discussion today. We would want to leave you with a verse in the Bible, in the book of Romans, chapter 12 and verse 9 that says, Let love be without hypocrisy, abhor what is evil and cling to what is good. God bless you.